Hi guys! Today I'm going to do a little hair tutorial with my new uh, Conair Instant Heat Spiral Iron. Uh, this is different than the one I did last time that was the Remington one. And so far I actually love, love, love this iron. As you can see it's a little bit um, like lengthier than the normal curling iron. It's got a smaller clip. And yes, I'm going to show you and if you're wondering, this is how the things kind of turn up and down. It does have a turbo heat to go on. I don't have it on right now. But yeah, I'm going to get straight started. I always say that. Straight started. So stupid. See, it's looking a hot mess right now. I like using the Suave Heat Protection Spray all over my hair. Also, it smells good. I like to make sure I get my bangs and my ends especially. Kind of dry it out a little bit. And the hairspray I use is the Garnier Fructis Full Control Ultra Strong Hairspray. Love the way this smells and I just love the flexible hold it has. And the teasing brush I have is, oh sorry I got the hiccups, is uh, the Con Air Teasing Brush or Bristles, whatever. Um, I'm just going to do a little bit now when I'm waiting for that to dry. So I do a little bit in my bang, a little teasing. So I have a little bit ahead. I don't like doing it after I curl. That's just me. Where my face always gets like super flat and I hate that. Don't want my super flat hair. part of it, the natural part, just over here. Now I'm just going to section it off of my ear. Take all this and clip it up. And this is the first time I'm actually doing it with my full hair. Uh, the other times I just kind of did pieces with my hair straightened. I'm going to brush it out a little bit. I know I got severe root. Crazy. And I already had this heating up. So, I'm going to sort of grab about pieces about this length. Angle the clip piece down and start curling. I got to curl between the little spirals. Just for about five seconds. Three, four, five, and then I just kind of let it go. I always want to twirl it the opposite way for some reason of the spirals. I have no idea why, I just do. And then when I'm sitting there, kind of loosen this up a bit and just make sure I get all the ends. We just let it go. I mean, obviously, if I held it in longer, it'd be like even more of a like a spirally tight curl. But I don't want it looking like Shirley Temple here. Just gonna loosen it up a bit. Get it there with four, five, and drop it. 